Is this your place? Well, if it is, it's a terrible way to introduce yourself. Look, it's been a long day. Quit with the shenanigans and just answer the question. No, it's not my place. I follow the signs here. Sometimes I make jokes in intense situations, and there's a sharp object stabbing me in the back, and I would like it to not go any further. Don't worry. It's just a harmless butter knife. Harmless, huh? I mean, unless you made a butter, it's probably the most harmless thing here. Yeah, I bet it is. Oh, no. Oh, it's just one. It followed me on the way over here, but I thought I got far enough away from it. Dang. Things getting too close to where I hang my hat. How many times do I have to make an example of your kind? <sighs> Must be guess. Yes, that's what brought them here. Bo would be proud. Welcome, fellow survivors of the apocalypse. This is my lovely abode. I hope you finally stay here welcoming. All the other apartments are empty. Except for the dead, of course. Now, where are my manners? My name's Billy. Mabel? Darian? Well, maybe after some food, you two can warm up to me. Now, sit, sit, and I will have something for you guys in a jiffy. What do you think? I don't know. I still don't know what to think about you. You don't trust me? You did try to kill me. With a butter knife? I trust you more than I trust him. What, like 30 seconds sooner? Oh my god, shut up. Now, who's ready for some sandwiches? <laughs> so, so you just grabbed the knife? <laughs> yeah, I mean, it was just the closest thing I could find. Well, I'll tell you, that is a riot. I haven't had a laugh like that in quite some time. Yeah, it's funny, all right. Well, now that the ice is broken, why don't you two tell me how you ended up here? Yeah, I don't think we should. Oh, well now of course you should. See, those signs were the brainchild of my best friend Bo. And he would love to hear the success if he was still here. Oh, I'm sorry for your loss. I mean, I guess we can. For your friend Bo. Great. Darian. You can go first. Wait, what? Tell the story about how you got here, of course. I had gotten separated from my group while on a supply run, and I was being chased by these Mad Max wannabe guys called the Rocket Millers. They seemed to be chasing me for the fun of it. Then we came upon a horde. <sighs> no. There were so many. I hid in the woods until I thought it was safe. When I thought it was, that's when I saw the sign. I followed them until I got here. Wonderful. Just wonderful. Now your turn. Alright. Well, our camp got overrun by a horde. I tried to fight them off, but there was just so many, and they were just everywhere. So I had to run. But in the forest, they just, they're all around you and they just surround you. God, they were everywhere. I ran harder than I ever have before. <laughs> and that's when I saw the sun. I had nothing to lose. Everyone I knew was now dead. I got here a little before Darren and yourself. I'm sorry that everyone who will miss you is gone now. But now you have us. And I'm sure that you'll find these apartments better than expected. Tomorrow, we'll clear out a room for the two of you. Oh, we aren't together. Yeah, we just met. Our story should have made that clear. Oh, my bad. Well, we should clear out too then. Wait, what about your story? Oh, yes. The story about Bo and myself. Well, there really isn't much to tell, really. See, we lived here before the outbreak. We survived and got by. You see, it was Bo who had the idea to bring people here to start a new community. We put up the signs together, but then one day, Told me to continue what we had started. Well, 
It is getting late, so you two better turn in. I will see you two in the morning. What do you think? I mean, it seems legit. I don't know. Something seems off about him. Well, I'm going to sleep, and I get the couch. Hey, equal rights. No, I still get the couch. But I'm going to go to change into something comfortable. You'll spoil your meat. Why? Bo had the right idea, but the wrong execution. Unfortunately, he had to be removed. Mabel? <sighs> Dead. But she gonna make a fine meal. Did you get her brain? What do you mean? I slid her wrist and she bled out in the shower. You don't understand. I saw what happened to her. No, that's not possible. <laughs> 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 <laughs>